So here I am on a Thursday morning. Just finished up working. I got one more thing on my list. I'm exhausted mentally, physically. This is not a great video. I can't even tell if it's my lack of glasses or if my lens is dirty, but that's why I hate doing these videos. I don't have time for it. So this is just a pathway, a shortcut through from one hole to the next, but it's also right on the edge of being in play. So people don't throw their shot correct. They do land in here. I need to get rid of this walnut tree, big branch that fell. So that's the last thing I'm doing today. It's dripping sweat out here today. The weather's horrible, hot. So I've got pretty much everything done. What have I done today? This morning, hole 15, cleaned out a bunch of vines on the uh, left side of the fairway, just in between, like, just trying to walk through areas like this. The vines are overtaking everything. I've been keeping those somewhat maintained. I'm not keeping up with everything out here. It's lagging behind. I'm just trying to keep up with everything I can do myself. So 15, 17, we had a big, I don't know, I'll try to come up. I'm gonna try to go up there and show it. Like right now, we just have grapevines covering everything. We're so far behind on all that stuff. I can't do it. So it's unfortunate, but it's the state of the course. Everything else is good and playable. I've kept everything, fairways looking nice. Kept the down limbs off the course everything I can do, but can't do everything. So let's go over to 17 here. 17, what I did this morning. I'm gonna try to stay in here and do it because I don't have the energy to go all the way up there. We'll see if it focuses all there. So there's the basket. And just left of the basket, we've got a group of bushes and basically just left of the basket and those bushes were overgrowing into the green i'm sorry into the fairway and the green just exploded in growth and they need to be cut back and open that line back up i did that this morning got rid of some vines on the trees a little bit not much and then the other thing i did this morning was, I'm gonna walk up that way actually. We've got a tournament here tomorrow and the grass needs to be cut so badly. So the other thing I did this morning, hole one, actually a couple other fairways that needed a lot less attention, but hole one, on the right side of the fairway, I'm just going to stand here and do it, honestly. I'm going to stop here soon in the shade. It is exhausting out here. So, those trees straight ahead on the right side of the fairway on hole one. I had to lift those up because they were touching the ground. So, I lifted them up to about three feet or above on everything on the fairway and then I made a pile right there for the city to grab. We got piles all over the course for the city to grab that aren't being done so that's what it is. Do have some trees right next to the basket way down there. They're newer younger trees and I'm not really messing with them. They could use some lifting but the long-term plan is to let them grow up and keep those branches that I would cut today. If I cut them today, they won't grow later. So those are two very valuable young trees that we want to just mature up. So I'm not doing anything to them. This kind of stuff around here is stuff that we're behind on. This honey locust right here, all this needs to be removed. 
all the ivy on the bottom of the trees, just a whole list of stuff that needs to be done. I just can't keep up on it. I, my video camera, if it's, if my video camera is out of focus or foggy or anything like that, it's because I've been forced to take videos of what the work I do out here and I don't have the time or I don't have a camera person standing there filming me the whole time so I have to set this down near what I'm doing. It just doesn't work. So I'm just doing this afterwards instead of trying to film while I'm working. It's exhausting just mentally also. So this morning, on my way here, I drive past another city park, and that city park has about 10 people of traffic per day, if that. And that lawn is cut. But this course where we have 50 people a day, this park, we can't get anybody to cut the grass. So, we're just stuck in a rut. We have shared commitments and apparently just, just today in this month, I'm the pers only person really giving this course the time and attention that it needs. And I can't wait till this month is over and I can only hope that I'm going to get some help, but I don't have any idea what's going on, seriously. Did a lot of emails and texts with the city asking and pleading for their help this month because I am by myself. I asked them to step up and do their job so that we can keep this park nice and that failed miserably. Stopped emailing me, stopped texting me. So I'm just here because I'm required to do these videos now. It's a shame that it's what it's come to. It's a bad deal. So I'm just walking across 17 here. 17 on my list is all that ivy that needs to be done and it's just another thing on my list that needs to be done that I when when I find the time it's so crazy that I'm making these videos seriously this part right here I this is like a walkway and we normally just drive the tractor through here and stuff but this is on my list too all this stuff needs to be done and as soon as somebody stops doing it that's when you notice that somebody's doing it well since nobody's doing it this is a problem now so another thing on my list this is the biggest problem on the whole course this grapevine these grapevines are taking over everything because we're not keeping up on our job I, I'm just sorry, I just can't do it all. I'm doing everything I can and I'm not keeping up. So, course is looking good and playable, but there's so much stuff that we're behind on that we would do, do in the years past. Okay, so I'm gonna go finish up that stuff um between six and seven and then get out of here it's like 10 o'clock something and it's starting to really get hot out here i've been out here oh about three and a half hours i'd say it's pretty nice this morning had a nice cool breeze I'm going to make my way back to the beginning, back to the car and get some supplies for that last job of the day. So here's 17th fairway. All this ivy 
right here needs to be knocked down to six inches or less because as soon as this stuff grows up, I've probably said this in a video before, as soon as this thing, this thing is two feet in two weeks and if that goes another week or two, then that becomes a hard stalk and I can't cut it with my weed eater anymore. It causes big problems. So this is on the list. All this needs to be done. I, I can't even schedule this stuff. I just come up here and do whatever I can when I can. But I've got it ready for tomorrow. Here's something that's been sitting on the fairway for a week that I haven't touched because I haven't had the time. I could do it right now, but I could do a thousand other things right now. So that thing, that's just stuff that it's not gonna cause any problems tomorrow. I can let that go. It doesn't have to be perfect, but man, we have to keep some kind of standards around here. All right, I'm going to go to the car and get some tools and finish up for today. I have to make these videos on work that I'm doing out here, so this is just another one of them. All right, I'm out.